Clock has started. Yes, sir. Reading you loud and clear. This is Freedom 7. The fuel is go 1.2 G. Cabin at 14 PSI. Oxygen is go. Cabin pressure is holding at 5.5. Cabin holding at 5.5. Okay, it's a lot smoother now. A lot smoother. Roger. Seven here. Fuel is go 4 G. 5.5 cabin, oxygen go, all systems are go. On the periscope, what a beautiful view. Cloud cover over Florida, three to four tenths near the eastern coast. Obscures up through Hatteras. They can see Okeechobee, identify Andros Island, identify the reefs. Giant retro sequence, in retro attitude, are green. Control is smooth. Retro one, very smooth. Retro two, retro three, all three retros are fired. This is Kennedy Launch Control, T minus 30 minutes and counting. T minus 30, all elements of the Apollo 14 countdown still go at this time. At this point in the count, the Apollo 14 lunar module uh, named Antares is now going on internal power. There are two batteries in the ascent stage and four batteries on the descent stage of the lunar module for Apollo 14. If the uh, lunar module will remain internal for some 20 minutes uh, until the 10 minute mark in the count as we look, uh, take a final look at the lunar module systems before we're ready to commit to fly. The LEM then again will be powered down at the 10 minute mark in the, the countdown. Still well ahead on a number of functions, the astronauts standing by in the spacecraft, all still going well. T minus 29 minutes, 10 seconds and counting. This is Kennedy Launch Control. This is Kennedy Launch Control. Mark, we have resumed our countdown. T minus eight minutes and counting on Apollo 14. We're still keeping a close eye on our weather conditions at this time, but Launch Director Walter Caprian has made the determination to resume the count. This should put us with a liftoff at three minutes past the hour if all continues to go well. All is uh, still going well as far as launch vehicle, spacecraft, and the three astronauts on board. Coming up in the seven minute mark. Mark, seven minutes and counting. This is Kennedy Launch Control. 40 seconds and counting. Alan Shepard reports that he's performing his final guidance alignment. The final uh, maneuver the astronauts performed before liftoff. 30 seconds and counting. Stu Russo just said thanks. It's been a good count. 25 seconds and counting. We are still go. There we go. 20 seconds, guidance alert, the guidance system now going internal. 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, ignition sequence start. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 0. Launch command, liftoff, we have liftoff in Apollo 14, 3 minutes past the hour. The tower is clear. I do, you have good thrust and all that. Okay, you can roll complete. I sure roll complete. Shepard report roll program completed. Pitch profile still in progress. 37 seconds. Stand by for mode 1 Bravo. Mark, 1 Bravo now. Okay, we're 1 Bravo. Capcom Gordon Fullerton making that report. Pressure coming down, adjusting from sea level to a space environment. Status check in mission control, coming up all greens on the flight director's console. In Houston, everything looks good here on the ground. Through Max Q. Mode 1 Charlie. Mark, 1 Charlie now. We're 1 Charlie, EDS auto is off. We're coming up on uh, center engine shutdown. 
Three minutes, 12 seconds, 20 nautical miles in altitude. Inboard cutoff. Roger, inboard. Center engine shut down on time. Two minutes, 25 seconds, 25 nautical miles in altitude, 30 nautical miles downrange. Two minutes, 35 seconds, uh, coming up uh, on staging. Roger. Hands separation. Roger. Engine on five. Roger. The crew now riding on five good second stage engines. On five engines. Good thrust on all five. All 14 Houston, the booster is safe and your orbit is go. Roger. Good show. Go orbit, booster safe.